now an associate professor at the chemical engineering department of the Kumasi Polytechnic. Professor Se Usu Echiang says government's move to convert the polytechnics into technical universities will boost academic progression. The bill to convert six out of the ten polytechnics into fully-fledged technical universities was passed by parliament last week. With the passage, the Kumasi, Accra, Sunyai, Ho, Takradi and Koforidia polytechnics are now technical universities. But not all are in favor of the law. Some scholars have argued conversion of the polytechnics into technical universities will not solve the problems confronting polytechnic education. But an associate professor at the Chemical Engineering Department of the Kumasi Polytechnic, Oseo Uswe Chao, described their session as baseless. So until now, after vocational training, technical training, that, that was the end of it. And, and these people who go to, to the workplace, you know, because of the level of their education, they weren't given the, the requisite respectability. So to give respectability to schools, acquisition, technical, vocational education, the government saw the need to upgrade it. So that if you finish tertiary uh, training, you have HND, you have degree in some vocational area, then you also go to the workplace. You also are a degree holder, so you, you, you are also respected. He believes government's move will boost academic progression at polytechnics in addition to their technical and vocational mandates. He wants intellectuals and the public to rally behind the implementation of the conversion process. The Chao underscored the need to resource the technical universities to deliver. When we were polytechnics, uh the, the expectations were not that so high. Now that we are universities, you know, we are, we are expected to play in the league of universities. So we need more resources, uh, physical facilities, you know. I think these are the immediate challenges. 